Okay, a first grade, when you get your folder tub, the folder holder will pull the folder out of the tub, open it up, give everybody a color wheel. Please return the folder to the tub. Your paper should be in front of you. And then we're gonna flip this around because that's when the supply manager will get the crowns that match your table out of the cup. Give everybody a crown. Everybody's gonna just write your name on a blank spot with that crown. And please return the crown to that cup that has a little crown picture. These will get out of our way and then we're gonna move on to our color wheel. So let's talk about the wheel that you see. There are three big circles and three small circles. Repeat after me. Put your finger on red. What color is this? Red. Move to yellow. What color is this? Yellow. Move across. This is blue. What color is this? Blue. Red, yellow, blue. These are our three primary colors. These are the most important colors. These are the three colors that make all the other colors in the rainbow. So when we get to our painting, on the red circle, we're gonna paint red, on the yellow, yellow, on the blue, blue. Now let's look at the little circles. We have orange, green, purple, or violet. So everybody put your finger on orange. Orange is a secondary color. This is where we're gonna do a double dip into two primary colors and mix it on the little circle to make orange. So if your two fingers are on orange, just like Miss Lawson's, if I move up, what color am I pointing to? Red. If I move down, what color am I pointing to? Yellow. So this color wheel gives us the answer on how to make the secondary color. Yellow and red make orange. Say it with me. Yellow and red make orange. So let's move down to green with our two fingers. Get your two fingers on green. Everybody, take your left finger, move it over to the word yellow. Take your right finger, move it over to blue. So yellow and blue make green. Say it with me. Yellow and blue make green. Now, let's move our two fingers to purple. If we got our two fingers, we're gonna move up. Red, move down. Blue, red and blue make purple. Red and blue make purple. So our color wheel answers are all right there in front of us. So I'm gonna call the supply manager to go to the back counter to get our paint. Please listen when you get to the tray that matches your table. You're gonna have the, have the house. Make sure you pick it up. You'll see our tippies in there. Take your house, dump it in the other cup, put the house back. Remember, this is where we grab the handle, not the danger zone. So make sure everybody has a tippy in their hand. Remember the extra cup, this is where we're gonna put the tops in a minute. And then the area in the back is where we put paints Miss Lawson we're not using today. So let me get this over here. Now, I'm gonna leave my paintbrush on my table. I'm gonna have the table captain pop the tops of all three of our colors. Please leave them on the tray. You may have three colors to pop, you may have more. So depending on how many students, you may have to pop them on the other side. Now we have our three primary colors open. So please listen and watch. I will tell you when it's time to put our paintbrush in the paint. When we are painting, we wanna make sure the color word goes the color on the word. We're gonna stay in the circle. When we're ready to clean our tippy, that's when we wipe them back and forth on to our um, paint mat. So please listen and watch Miss Lawson before you do any painting. Okay, let me get myself ready. So again, we're painting the three big circles with the three colors we use. We are going to start with the lightest, which is yellow. Then we'll wipe it off and move to red, wipe it off and move to blue. So please watch me. And then when I pause it, you will copy. So I'm taking my brush, dip it in yellow, paint my circle that says yellow, wipe it off. back and forth, making sure you're going back and forth. Once we've got yellow done, we're gonna to move to red. Paint the red circle. Wipe it off, going back and forth. Last is blue, dip a little blue, wipe it off. 
And no, you're not going to get your paintbrush completely clean. Okay, now that we have our three primary colors on our color wheel, we're going to move to our secondary colors. Please listen and watch. It's very important. First of all, the way we dip is very important. You always want to hold your brush straight up and down, not to the side, up and down. When we go, we always go down into a color, pick it up, move it over, go down into the other color. We should not be stirring or scooping the paint out. For example, I'm going to put my finger in orange. I am going to do orange first. Please watch and listen. We are not painting until Miss Lawson tells you to. So again, orange is yellow and red. We always do the lightest color first. Yellow is lighter than red. So when I dip, I'm going to dip yellow, then I'll dip red, then I'll mix on the orange. So please watch. Down, up, move over, down, up, go to my orange dot and mix. So once I've done that, I need to wipe my tippy off on my paint mat and get ready for color number two. Now we're going to move to green. Yellow and blue make green. Yellow and blue make green. Remember, the lightest color we're going to dip first, which is yellow. Then we'll dip to blue. So please watch and listen before you begin. I go straight up and down, down and up into the yellow, down and up into the blue and go straight to mix green. Wipe it off on my mat. Now remember, if you saw me, I did not move my paintbrush in the cup. If you are moving your paintbrush in the cup, you're gonna mix our colors on the cup. We wanna mix on the paper. Purple, red and blue, red and blue. Red is the lighter of blue. So we'll dip red, then blue, then mix. Again, watch and listen. Down and up in the red, down and up in the blue, go to purple. Now, I don't know if you can see, there's a problem with my purple. It looks too red. Here, how, here is how I solve that problem. I take my brush, I clean it off. Now, because the purple is too red, I don't want to add more red to it. I'm just going to go over to the blue and add a little blue and mix some blue on top and it's gonna change and there's my color purple. So if you're looking at your secondary color and you see that it's too red, if it's a purple, add more blue. If it's too blue, add more red. You always wanna add the opposite. Now we have our primary and our secondary painted on our color wheel. So we are gonna take our house. The supply manager is gonna grab the house. Please make sure your tippy goes bottom down, hair up, that goes back on the tray. Table captain, when I tell you, you'll grab your tops. Do not just lay them. If you lay them, the paint will dry out. Once you put them, press, press, oops, press. Keep it on the tray so they don't spill. Once our paint is closed and our tippies are in our house, supply manager will walk our tray back to the counter. Don't forget to dump our tippies into the pool. Everybody else, you're gonna be listening when to pick up your paint mat and your artwork to walk it back to Miss Lawson so we can get it on the drying rack.